So the, uh, I got into the hut in the end last night, uh, let in by Dragov and Tony, who looked after me very well. Um, but it's continued to rain like all night and some of the local towns are totally flooded. People have died. The emergency services are trying to help people. There's been people airlifted. It's like a, a full on um, national emergency. And uh, Dragos, the, the hut manager says that the path from here to Idria, which is where I'll be walking, crosses loads of little streams and they're probably all gonna be bulging and flooded, flooding the path, which makes sense because I saw a bit of that yesterday, actually. There was one path where the, the, the stream next to it was just like a torrent and if it had gone up another foot, it would have took the path with it. So he said it's, it's dangerous to hike because I could end up down a path and get stuck. Um, so he's offered to give me a lift actually into Idria, which is very kind. And I think I'm going to take him up on that offer. It'll be miserable today anyway. No views. I've got all my stuff dry now and I'll be wet within five minutes. So that's what I'm going to do. It seems sensible. And the Alpine Association of Slovenia have also issued a warning saying don't hike, basically. It literally says there's no reason to hike in this weather. It's just dangerous. And all the emergency services are swamped, so don't don't be a dick, basically. So yeah, that's that's today. Head into Idria. I'll find a coffee shop or something. Let's go and sit there until I can check in to the hostel that I was going to stay in tonight anyway. And I'll go and find somewhere to get dinner. So, no hiking today. But uh, another phase to the adventure. A journey in Dragos's car. Ah. Made it to Idria, got my favourite blueberry yoghurt. It's still raining and I can't check into my hostel till 4 so I'm going to go around the mercury mine because that should be, should be fun, interesting and inside. Uh, but yeah, kind of got saved by Good Samaritan of Dragos. The roads were crazy, like all the rivers and streams have just swollen up so much and some of the bits of road like we only just got through so He's done me a big favour there, because I could have got in a mess in the hills. So, back in civilization. <laughs> 